Welcome to Cascade Sports. I'm Marlo Garlington. We're here with Kyle Weems. We're at the Kansas City Fieldhouse at the Pro-Am League. Kyle, what's going on? What's up, man? How you doing? All right. Um, give us a little rundown of your basketball career from high school thus far. Uh, went to Holland Park High School in Topeka, Kansas. Um, won two state titles. Um, in 04, I was a freshman, didn't get a lot of playing time. Um, we were 19 and 6, and then my senior year we went 25 and 0, um, undefeated state champs. Went to Missouri State um, in 2007, 2008. Red shirted my first year. Um, was all freshman my first year playing. Um, all freshman team averaged about 10. Uh, second season averaged about 13. Second team all Valley, and then. Junior year helped lead my team to the first ever conference championship in school history. Um, we got snubbed out of the tournament, but we made it to the second round of the NIT. Um, I was Missouri Valley Player of the Year that year, my junior season, averaged about 16. Then the next year, my senior year, was first team all Valley again. Um, didn't get Player of the Year, but still had a good year, averaged about 15 and 8. Um, then this past year, my rookie season, um, to start off the year, I played. Golden State in Toronto in last year's summer league. Then I went to Bonn, Germany, played in the BBL, which is uh, the basketball Bundesliga in Germany. Um, averaged about 13 and 4 or 5. Um, played well in the playoffs, so um, just kind of a waiting game right now. Going to Atlanta to play with them in the summer league this summer, uh, here in a couple weeks out in Vegas, and just looking forward to that. So just trying to stay ready. Are, um, are you playing with on any team right now? Yeah, um, not even. I feel bad. This is my first game playing today. Not really sure of the team, but Pat Corey, um, Jeff Hawkins, um, Aaron it goes to UNKC. So he's got a nice team. Um, we play the game the right way. It's my first game. I'll play next week before I head out to Vegas for two games. So I'm looking forward to it. Okay. Um, is it any competition out there for you? Oh, for sure, man. These are guys that I grew up playing against: Dominique Morrison, George Good, Ramon Fletcher, Marcus Walker, um, Donald Johnson. Um, Quinn Day, Leo Lyons, I mean, these are guys I play with every day down here, whether it's Penn Valley or North Kansas City, so um, just wanted to be a part of this this summer because last year I missed out. Right. How do you think your team will fare uh, among the competition right now? Uh, I think we'll, I think we hang in there. Um, we got some guys that are a little bit older, but they play the game. They know the right, they know how to play. Um, everybody shares the ball, so nobody suffers. So I think that's key in stuff like this because people come out and watch. A lot of people try and do too much, but... I think, I think we're going to be great. So, uh, you know, we got to win today. Looking forward to getting, uh, trying to get two more wins next Sunday. You know, we'll see what we can do. All right, last question. Um, Cascade Sports, being home of the student athlete, tell us how important it is and the youth, how important education is uh, with playing sports. It's huge. Um, obviously, you know, everybody knows, uh, you know, grades are everything. Um, if you don't pass that ACT or SAT, whichever one you take, you're not going to school. So, um, you know, it's very important to, to hit that head on. I passed mine my junior year, so I didn't have anything to worry about my senior year. Um, and then when I got to school, I took summer school every year um, so I could graduate early, if not on time. Because um, it's tough being a Division One athlete. You got so many obligations, so many people to go see on a day-to-day -day basis. Um, so obviously school, and if you don't keep your grades up, you don't play. So nobody wants to to be the last to stock of school and being eligible and everybody asking why you're not playing. So, But I graduated with a degree in hotel and restaurant administration with a minor in business. Um, knocked my internship out, internship out my first year, or my, excuse me, my fourth year. And uh, just had just kind of some, some play around classes for my senior season. So uh, by taking care of business, it can benefit you in the long run. Um, I use my red shirt year to, to benefit me. Um, and, uh, you know, I'm just blessed and I got that piece of paper with me the rest of my life. Great. Well, we want to wish you well in your future endeavors. Thank you, Kyle, for your interview on CascadeSports.tv. Appreciate you having me. Thanks. What's up, Kansas City? This your girl, Aisha. I'm Brianna. And this is your girl, Mike Shano Mike. And we are CMG. CMG. We want you to check out our videos at CascadeSports.tv, home of the student athlete. And what's up, KansasCity.net, the premier outlet for Kansas City. And always remember, the victory we call success goes to the best prepared. And when you invest in your community, you're really just investing in yourself. So, don't just like it, share it.